All you 20-somethings, you fall in love with your esports. I got your back, okay? I'll, 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 from now on, I won't bang on you too hard. But I want you to rely on Uncle Colin for something. Actually, NBA that happened 20 years ago. I am now old enough that I've watched the NBA. It was the first sport I really watched. Because um, where I grew up in the country, the teams were really good. I've been watching NBA for about 45 years. Okay, and there's two or three things about the NBA that pe- even Bill Simmons falls for it. People get too caught up in regular seasons. I told Simmons that. Simmons gets all worked out. Regular seasons, guys are just trying to stay healthy because all the money is playoffs. That's when the shoe companies want you to be on TV. They want you to play in the Olympics, and the shoe companies and the agents want you to play in the playoffs. It's all Kyrie Irving could be healthy. They're not putting him on till television and Christmas. Nobody's risking that. That's the way the NBA's worked for 45 years, is there's a series of regular season games. You want your stars to be ready to play for the league. The commissioner wants you. The owner wants you. The shoe companies want you. Your agent wants you. It's the Christmas Day game. That's when the NBA season starts. Christmas Day, people watch the league. Then they start really watching April. Then May and June, it's fantastic. That's when you want to be ready to play. People experiment until Christmas. They mess around until Christmas. It's not even really till post-Christmas. You put in the defenses you want to use. You don't want to give stuff away. You want to experiment. You want to play young kids. You want to figure out rotations. So anyway, sorry, just had an apple. You're getting very excited. Anyway. <laughs> That's the number one thing. Number two is, in the history of this league, finesse can win you a championship. Finesse gets talked about. Tough guys win in this league. Tough guys win in this league. Let me tell you something right now. You put in 23-year-old Draymond Green and 23-year-old Clay and 23-year-old Curry, and, and you put them in an alley with Rodman and MJ and Pippen, it ain't even close in an alley? What what competition yeah, are we having? Because are that's, they playing basketball or That's fighting? what the playoffs are. They're a, they're a fight in an alley. That 95-96 Bulls team could beat you on the three, could beat you on the two, could beat you in the alley, could beat you on the boards. They could go small. They could go big. It is the greatest defensive team. I've been watching the NBA for 45 years. There, And I'm not somebody who is an MJ sycophant. I've ripped MJ for years for being selfish and into MJ. I am, And I think Magic Johnson is a lot closer to MJ historically than anybody's ever said. MJ, Magic Johnson made everybody, made the league better, made the franchise better. That 95-96 Bulls team is the greatest professional sports team I have ever seen in any league at any time. They were tough, physical, cerebral, intellectual, smart. Uh, they, could, they could go long. They could go short. They were good in crisis. They hit great free throws. They were everything. There's never been a professional team like that. I mean, they had guys like Ron Harper. You go back to the Bulls in their prime. They had guys that were, could have scored 20 a night in other cities that said all score eight and play defense. They were unbol- they were the best they were the best pressing team. They were the best shooting team. They were the most physical team. They were the most competitive team. They were the best team with two minutes to go in a game. Oh, come on. Warriors against that team? Come Intel- on. Intellectual and smart are words I would use, though, for the Warriors. And, and I oh, thought the Bulls no. were great. Oh, really? I think Michael Jordan is one of the smartest players between Phil Jack, even Rodman, who everybody makes fun of. Rodman was a very smart basketball player. Michael Jordan and LeBron and Magic are the th- and, and Kobe's bright. They understand the angles. They understand spacing. They understand body. They understand manipulating officials. So that you- Bulls team's the greatest professional sports team I have ever seen easily. So and you- I th- and the Lakers Showtime Lakers were fantastic. They be- they may be number two. You don't think Steph Curry is intellectual and smart? I'm not saying that. I'm saying that Bulls team was everything. Like you know, that team could beat you in seven ways. They could beat you at the line. They could beat you in the paint. They could beat you on threes. They could beat you on twos. They could beat you defensively. Never forget, they averaged 105 a game when you could basically club people in the league.